Hi, I'm Rowena from McMorgan Next Practice Marketing and in this video we're going to talk about the second stage of applied design thinking which is called empathize. So first of all, what is empathy? It's basically being able to sense what other people are feeling, to put yourself in their shoes. And the reason why empathy is so important is so we can really come up with the best insights on how to solve. So empathy and the different ways we do empathy is ultimately all about getting insights which can help us come up with innovative solutions that consumers need and want. So now we understand empathy, what are the different ways we can achieve empathy? Well, I'm gonna to talk to you about three different, different techniques. The first is called observe, and this is where we observe or watch people in their normal environment. So this could be in-home visits, where you watch people use a certain product or service. It could be going into retail stores, observing what people do, or it could even be letting people play on the computer and observing the way that they use the computer, that they browse the web, etc. But basically it's about observing what they do. Now, why is this valuable? Well, often people will say and do different things, not because they mean to, but because we often have a lot of unconscious acts. So I worked for many years in skincare, and when you would ask women how many skincare products that they would buy, they would say, well, you know, maybe one every few months. I don't tend to use that many brands. I tend to use a couple of brands. However, when you go into their home and look into their bathroom cabinet, you're more likely likely to find 15 plus brands as well as a combination of different products that they will use for different situations. So what they say and what they do is quite different and that's where observation can be very insightful. The second one is around engage, which is where you're talking with consumers directly and trying to get deeper into their understanding and motivation to answer the why. So some of the techniques for Engage would be interviewing, focus groups, and really here you're trying to understand, peel back the, un the onion and really understand their beliefs, their values, and what is driving a certain behavior. The third one is around immersion, and this is where you actually step into their shoes. Now, common um, or most practiced techniques for immerse is when you do consumer journey mapping, or you actually go with a consumer on a journey and understand what they do, why they do it, and how they're doing it. So immersion is really putting yourself in their shoes so you can understand the bigger why and how those pieces all connect. So empathy again is sensing what others are feeling. And these three techniques are all really valuable ultimately in us gaining insights that can help us bring to market much better innovations.